Банде Гуру Падад Дандам Бхакта Бинду Саманитам Сри Чайтанна Прабхум Банде Нитананда Саходитам Сри Нанда 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 Радика Чарано Дайям Гопи Яно Самаюктам Ван Чакал Патару Вашаки Пасинду Вевача Патитананг Павуне Бхавишна Вибью Наму Намаха Мукан Кароти Бача Ланг Пангунг Ланг Хатигирим Джатки Патама Хангабанди Шна Бхакти Паде Деви Шатта Ваттвай Наму Нама Нараяна Намаскитта Наранча Ива Нараттама Девин Сарасватин Весам Тато Джайо Мадире Шанкиртани Кишна Катху Падеша Гаурия Патрасша Пракаша Неча Садану ракта гуру бхакти юкта, бхакти прамодакша джагу баран, дейям сада пари бхагну мабишто духам, ты тас падам сива виринчану там сараням, битатихам панотопал бхават дипутам. Банде Махапурушате Чаруна Равиндам Ядпада Паллава Накачанда Маничатая Биспуриджита Кемапига Бодушева Дарши Пурунам Рагара Сусагара Сара Мурти Сарадика Майкада Кипам Кадош Си Кишна Чайтанна Прабхунита Ананда Сиаддай Тагададхара Сивасади Гаура Бхакта Винда Си Кришна Чайтанна Прабхунита Ананда Сиаддай Тагададхара Сивасади Гаура Бхакта Винда Харе Кришна Харе Кришна 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 Харе 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 Рам, Харе Рам, Рам Рам, Харе Харе. Аджану ламмито бхуджо канока бодато, Шанкиртано и капитаро камала ятакшо, Вишам бару дижа бару Банде Джагат Приякару, Каруна Абхадару, Хари Кишна, Хари Кишна, 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 Хари, 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 Рам, Хари, Рам, 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 Хари, Хари, Намами Ганги. Банкаджам, сура, сура, ирбандито, тип барупам, буктин, чамуктин, чададасинитам, баван, рупе, калапам. Гори нирантара бигуши табана бхагам Нараяно приямананго мада пахарам Барану сипурапати бхажави шанатам Баги саджасу бадане Лакшмир Ясясте хида самбит пам шинга махамбаджи 
हरे कृष्ण हरे कृष्ण 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 हरे 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 राम हरे राम 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 हरे हरे अभिमान परित्यज्य प्राकृत बपुरादिषु श्री कृष्ण कृपया गोपी देहे ब्रजे वसा अहम राधिकाचरी भूत्वा पारकियो रसे सदा राधा कृष्ण विलासेशु परिचर्या कौमि अहम अभिमान परितज्यो प्राकृत बपुरादिषु श्री कृष्ण कृपया गोपी देहे ब्रजे वसा अहम राधिकाचरी भूत्वा पारकियो रसे सदा राधा कृष्ण विलासेशु परिचर्या कौमि अहम गौरीय गोष्ठीपति गौरीय गोष्ठीपति शिशील भक्ति सिद्धांत सरस्वती को स्वामी ठाकुर प्रभुपाद परमहंस जगत गुरु टोल्ड दैट अपराकृत मधुर रस अपराकृत रूपानुग भजन इट इज आर एक्चुअल टारगेट दैट इज द टॉप मोस्ट लास्ट टारगेट ऑफ आर्स टू अचीव बट इट डजेंट मीन दैट दैट इन द इन अ वेरी अनराइव स्टेट in that unripe state that we will be just uh, uh, going into opposite direction aur ye goshtipati shri shila bhakti se dan saraswati ko swami thakur prabhupad paramhans jagat guru told that definitely raganuga bhajan rupanuga bhajan that is the topmost target that maduras bhajan that is a topmost final target it should be there for us but it doesn't mean that in the starting position when unripe position we can do anything what we want it is strictly prohibited to do that it is not at all good to perform raganuga bhajan it is not at all good to perform that in this that bhakti samaj that all uh, uh, wrong things will just get uh, get opened and all all the sahajyas what they are doing and if we will also be doing the same thing what the sahajyas are doing then according to our saraswat gaudiya vichar what is there that speciality where it will go propad speaking always used to speak that we have some speciality hum log we gaudiyas have some kind of speciality we are actually gaudiya devotees and we are actually saraswat gaudiyas we definitely have something very special we definitely have something special for us and this uh, special thing we actually just want to don't, don't want to just uh, uh, pull our neck for that and just want to kill that for this special point what we are having in we have to just rather have to preach that we just need to encourage that a special point in order to maintain that speciality of gaudiya vaishnav siddhant we just need to maintain that which is already there this is actually speciality is there of gaudiya vaishnav siddhant we just need to maintain that and just need to maintain the same pace for that so what kind of maintenance what kind of speciality what what kind of speciality maharaj you are speaking we actually are not at all understanding this point siddhant to vichar ka vishay that in the siddhant vichar vishay that regarding siddhant vichar the speciality regarding siddhant vichar specialty regarding seva that special special siddhant vichar and special with the special mood the uh, we have to do seva both the things are actually uh, the speciality and if we'll be doing a special vichar on this in depth analysis is will be doing on that then we can just get if we will be doing the in depth analysis in that then we can get that both things are same the speciality and seva both things because siddhant what it is jab 
when it is a it comes in applied form it comes in a applied form in our life then then it becomes seva for us and when then seva is getting different different kind of sevas are there is actually coming in the form of siddhant and is represented in the form of siddhant by the shastras that is called siddhant so seva and siddhant it is not at all different it is almost the same what is siddhant that is seva that's that is dry philosophy that is not at all dry philosophy that siddhant what we are speaking that is not at all dry philosophy that is not at all dry philosophy siddhant means that in order to satisfy bhagwan whatever you are doing in order to get the satisfaction of bhagwan what is the actual procedure you are following how you can just uh, uh, it is coming in the form of siddhant so if siddhant that kind of that we are actually um, uh, manifesting in seva then that it will become seva so that's why yesterday we were discussing this point propat that kind of uh, propat speaking in front of us that sadhan and siddhi in the bhumika of sadhan and siddhi that vivart whatever is there just if the vivart is introduced then jeev will become prakrit sahajya this point i have just already picked up yesterday and i'll be discussing it in brief today regarding this point that is the actual truth the in the sad in the sadak state who is there if he is thinking that i am siddh then what will be the effect of that what will be the after effect of that point up till uh, this is the most dangerous thing what he can think that is the top most dangerous situation and condition that that kind of viparjay cannot uh, get established in the life of a, that particular sadak just by doing a sadak under the guidance of pure guru vishnu slowly steadily by doing bhajan under their guidance can become siddh and what do you mean by siddh ha huh? siddh what do you mean by siddh this condition what do you mean by siddh sila bhakti vallabh tirth ko swami maharaj ji in a very joking mood used to speak that you are anu siddh or patal siddh <laughs> whether you have just a siddh like or like a potato or a par- parbal you have just make siddh <laughs> siddh means actually in the other sampraday in the sam- other sampraday there are lot of sampradays are there there are infinity sampradays are there there are infinity sampradays are there different different kind of sampradays are there and inside them that is siddh this word actually with what they are using their different kind of uh, uh, meaning is that uh, meaning is they are giving for siddh they are giving different different kind of vichars for siddh different different kind of vichar they are making but but our in our gaudiya vichar that siddhi that siddh means that seva siddhi siddh siddh means that to get seva siddhi in seva slowly steadily by doing seva seva he has becoming topmost uh, siddh just slowly steadily he has become seva moy just by doing more and more seva just slowly steadily by doing seva seva he is becoming seven moy full of seva like our narhari prabhu who are we, we are speaking as the mother of goryamat we are actually speaking the mother of goryamat to him this narhari prabhu he is actually prabhupad used always used to speak him as to give all the seva of uh, chaitanya mat to whole chaitanya mat seva prabhupad actually has given on to the shoulders of has just given on the palms of uh, narhari prabhu and without any tension prabhupad has given the whole seva always used to preach hari katha kirtan about gorvani just by giving the whole seva to narhari uh, Nar, uh, this our this prabhu our prabhu narhari prabhu if he is not at all there if he is not there then what what will be the condition if narhari prabhu was not there then what will be the condition this kind of vichar is coming narhari prabhu chaitanya mat ka in chaitanya mat 
in order to do the seva of chaitanya mat he along with that that kind of oneness he has got he got oneness with the seva what prabhupad has given to him he was just one and the same with chaitanya mat seva oneness ek ekta prapt he has just got oneness with the chitanya mat seva he has done so much seva so much seva that even a brahmachari some brahmachari or some seva cos he has done some wrong then whatever wrong he has done in order to narhari prabhu always used to rectify that problem all the time he used to find the solution of that problem very surprising to see that sometimes some brahmachari in bonded condition he is jameen jaya and he is speaking the seva of property and land if he has actually some argument with some ghosh ghosh means that those who are actually just staying in dham they are actually ghosh in mayapur dham they are actually ghosh in vrindavan also there are ghosh they are actually those who are selling uh, cows uh, they are those who are selling cows milk this ghosh with these ghosh ban brahmachari actually some arguing with the on property some misbehavior has done and uh, and uh, that was not at all good to do that and what happened in that that all the ghosh they have just all together came in front of chaitanya mat and with all full of sticks they just want to kill that brahmachari in order to just kill that brahmachari and they just came in front of mat and at that time what happened narhari prabhu just with folded hands they are he is actually just standing in front of them speaking narhari just by seeing narhari prabhu they are all stick everything just become cold because that all those ghoshas they are all sticks what they have just picked up to kill that brahmachari it all become cold and they just uh, speaking very nice two to four sweet words to them and after that the solution of that problem just came prabhupad just become so much happy with narhari prabhu why because just by doing so much seva he has he has become sevan mai that's why his name boy his name was given that's why his name was given narhari seva vikra his name was narhari seva vikra narhari seva vikra this is the actual name what the title he he got from prabhupad that is his actual name what he got from prabhupad just by doing seva slowly steadily he become sevan mai prabhupad always used to speak those those sahajiya log jaisa those all those sahajiyas those who are doing bhajan and if we also will be doing bhajan like that in the same way like the actual present condition is going on gurudev always used to speak in regarding this shirdar goswami maharaj gurudev our gurudev also used to speak this point that in our own sampradaya only that uh, in the today's uh, the condition is like that so much actually in our own sampradaya that we are actually uh, manufacturing sahajiya so much uh, that kind of sahajiya that you can't even imagine that in our own sampradaya only we are actually to going outside we don't have any kind of adhikar to speak of the outer sahajiyas but we are actually manufacturing our own sahajiyas so specially regarding the siddhant vichar and specialty regarding seva this is the actual special point this kind of special point in order to in order to in order to just uh, make it in a living condition we just need to make the efforts to make it in living condition all the time so sadhan just by doing sadhan at that time if someone actually is thinking that i have just gone into the siddh bhumika siddh platform then it is actually one kind of vivarth like there is prem in prem vivarth i have already told and the under the anugatya prabhupad bhakti pramod purugas ko swami maharaj anugatya i have just told in prem vivarth under the anugatya bhakti no thakur bhakti no thakur has written that in prem vivarth what do you mean by prem vivarth this is actually prema this behavior this uh, whatever he is doing this is actually prem this is not a angry attitude but externally people external people can think that it is angry mood external people they can think that it is angry mood but that is actually prema it is not at all angry mood 
बट एक्सटर्नली इट लुक्स लाइक एंग्री मूड बट डैट इज एक्चुअली विवर्थ लाइक मायावादी पीपल ऑल्सो हैव विवर्थ मायावादी पीपल दे आर एक्चुअली विवर्थवाद मीन्स दैट दैट ब्रह्म इज स्वयं He has taken a distorted form. Brahm has just taken a distorted form, and has just came in this material world, and that is the actual parim varinam of this existence of the world has just came. But the, this is not the actual point. What they are actually picturizing. Brahm, in order to get the distorted form, Brahm don't need any kind of distorted form because Brahm is Brahm. ब्रह्म वाई वी विल बी टेकिंग द डिस्टोर्टेड फॉर्म वाई ब्रह्म ब्रह्म डोंट नीड एनी काइंड ऑफ डिस्टोर्टेड फॉर्म वाई बिकॉज ही इज ब्रह्म इन दिस मटीरियल वर्ल्ड इन दिस मटीरियल वर्ल्ड महाप्रभु स्पीकिंग महाप्रभु इज एक्चुअली गिविंग वन प्रूफ टू प्रकाशानंद सरस्वती दैट महाराज इन दिस मटीरियल वर्ल्ड दैट इफ दिस काइंड ऑफ That sparsh money, that stone you will be getting. Even the steel is actually getting converted into gold by that touch stone. So in this material world, if there is so much, one stone has so much capability to do this thing, then why actually Brahm will be, why Brahm will be getting into a distorted form? Why Brahm will be taking a distorted form? Brahm is actually nishkalank without any stain. It is actually vivartvad, mayavad. It is all mayavad conception. This they have just established this conception in front of us, which is totally wrong. So this uh, then at in sadan sid sadan and siddhi this two bhumika. If they are actually is getting uh, in the bonded state also, he is thinking that he is getting into the siddh state. That is called vivart. That is not at all good. mayavadi people they have this vichar that this material world this is not at all there mayavad people they are what they are speaking that this uh, all this material world what we are watching that this material world is not at all there are maharaj this material world is not there that what you are speaking yes material world is not there presently so then then it is just like a snake you are seeing there is one rope there is one rope present and it is just hanging down and in the night time you are thinking that this is a snake but when the light is just getting on it is just on it then we can just understand that this is just a rope this kind of example mayavadis used to speak always used to give this uh, this kind of example all the time they are giving this example but uh, the actual vichar that is totally opposite that in the rope that you are having this uh, kind of conception of snake in the in the layer rope actually is just uh, uh, is just uh, getting down and you are having this kind of brahm that it's a snake there is actually no fault in that but in this material world you are just uh, making as an imaginary it is just one kind of imagination this in order to think like that it is not at all good that is material world is imaginary why because mahaprabhu actually speaking okay that this material world is there but this material world is actually anitya temporary material world is not at all there how it is possible material world if it is not at all there then you are also not there then why you are actually speaking why actually why you are not at all there then why you are speaking why you are eating then why you are doing all these activities this is all rubbish concept this world is there definitely mahaprabhu speaking that this world is there but that is anitya that is temporary for a small time material world is not there how it will be possible so that actual vichar of mayavadis is like that that the rope is actually hanging down that there is actually some misconception of snake okay but our gorya vedantist vishuna chakravarti pad they they are all actually vedanti bal dev vidya bhushan their vichar is that okay 
in the snake in the rope there is actually one kind of conception of snake but snake also that object particular object if there is one object some is like snake is there definitely you just understand what i'm speaking that that person that he is actually having that misconception of a snake of a in a rope he is having misconception of a snake then for them they they don't have any kind of idea of snake that they, they that snake is not a uh, object if snake is not an object in this material world then snake is actually very poisonous and is very dangerous why this kind of uh, conception is coming and why kind of dangerous feeling is coming in you regarding snake that kind of dangerous conception why it will come in in front of you regarding the snake it is totally wrong so our gorya vedanti baldev vidya bhushan vishwana chakravarti everyone and rup goswami everyone is actually speaking okay you are having this misconception that conception of snake it is not at all uh, uh, it is not at all uh, false snake is definite snake is snake is definitely there so like this in sadhan and siddhi bhumika that kind of viparjay that vivart can definitely be there and if it is there then you will become prakrit sahajiya i definitely have already just discussed this point previously that prabhupad or indrada kund always uses speak loudly hey don't go there don't go there they are all actually sahajiyas they are all sahajiyas don't go there you come here prabhupad used to speak and sahajiya people in a very angry mood they came in front of prabhupad and crying loudly you are sahajiyas you are actually sahajiya you are actually crying on us that we are sahajiyas yes we are actually sahajiya yes you are right prabhupad speaking that is a topmost point what you are speaking but we are actually transcendental sahajiya that the actual transcendental world the prakrit jagat transcendental world that kind of uh, in vrindavan that sahaj dharm that natural dharm what is there that shri golok vrindavan's actual dharm that the actual bhav of the transcendental world that actual natural bhav of the transcendental golok vrindavan that kind of vichar is actually already there inside us that we are actually sahajya definitely but we are transcendental sahajya and you are material sahajya prakrit sahajya so that is the actual difference they actually just become shut up after that not at all speaking anything to prabhupad because don't have anything to speak to prabhupad so like this if we will be thinking uh, having this kind of vichar then we can understand to gauriya guru that uh, in gauriya guru parampara that in uh, rupanug dhara that connection of rupanug dhara is definitely there in our guru parampara shila rup ko swami par under the guidance of rup ko swami pas it's already uh, told there and up till this point of also that all our guru work from rup ko swami from rup ko swami pa jeev ko swami pa sanatan ko swami pa ragunath bhat ragunath das ko swami every ko swami they are all their all bhajan pandati if we are actually doing the actual vichar on it then we can just see that the shlok which i have already started with the shlok which i have already started with that is the actual uh, indication the shlok which i have already started with today that is the actual indication their their bhajan is giving to us abhimanam paritya jo shunya mein to it looks very simple to us just by hearing but practically in order to get in our life it is so much difficult that abhimanam paritya means that the first thing we have false ego that i am this purush i am this body i am male or i am female that i am female and you are male this kind of false ego is there definitely it is there of your body so this kind of false ego this abhimanam prati paritya that is openly actually described here in this point openly this is described in this point what is actually described that prakrit means that this material body this our body is there of this material in this material world 
that our material body there in this material world this kind of me and mind concept what is is coming that i am this uh, i am male you are actually female this kind of conception is all all rubbish conception that is all temporary conception maybe today that your wife is there you are actually becoming yashit that you are the actual uh, master of the yashit i this is my wife i am the master of her i am the actual swami of my wife <laughs> this kind of up till what point it will go this kind of vichar up till what point it will go you just tell me that that is actually anitya it is temporary just for a false small time so that's why that i am this i am male and i am female i am very much smart i am very beautiful by lo- external looking so this kind of which are i am a very um, big man my uh, family is very topmost so different different kind of uh, false ego is there and by this false ego all the bonded jiva are actually covered by that by this uh, um, false ego all the bonded jivas are actually covered by in all the four directions and in order to get out of that there is actually no other pathway open for us if one pathway is open then the, the persons who want to understand that point that is were that are very less it their pathway is definitely there this pathway not there it's not like that under the guidance of pure guru vaishnav just by doing bhagavad seva slowly steadily he'll be just uh, cutting the maya but uh, this kind of uh, tight uh, this kind of stamp who will give everyone can speak like an orator dry philosophy just but in order to give the actual stamp who is there to give that actual stamp so this uh, this is the actual uh, 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 hidden treasure of raganuga bhajan secrecy of raganuga bhajan the gaudiya math the actual the the actual secret treasure of gaudiya math bhajan gaudiya math bhajan is the to, total rupan rupanugatya we are doing bhajan that is called actual gaudiya bhajan there is some indication given in there that there is some indication regarding that that how we have to do bhajan for what particular object we have to do what will happen what will be the actual result by doing the bhajan so each and every condition is there in gaudiya bhajan ramma kachit upasana brjavad vargena jakalpita shrimad bhagavatam pramana mamalam prema kumarto mahano sri chaitanya mahaprabhu matam idam tatra dharana श्रीनाथ जी श्रीनाथ श्रीनाथ जी प्रवर्त श्रीमन महाप्रभु महाप्रभु इज एक्चुअल डिजायर इट मीन्स दैट वॉट इज द एक्चुअल हिडन ट्रेजर ऑफ गौड़िया मठ दैट इट इज एवरीथिंग इज गिवन बाय महाप्रभु एक्सटर्नली इन फ्रंट ऑफ अस वॉट इज दैट आराध्य वस्तु ब्रजेश्वर तनयम ब्रज ईशो इट मीन्स दैट ब्रज राजा द किंग ऑफ ब्रज ब्रजेशो मीन्स दैट ब्रजेशो मीन्स दैट ही दैट युक्त एशो हु इज द किंग ऑफ ब्रज ब्रजेशो तने इट मीन्स दैट द ब्रज राज नंद कुमार हि सन श्री कृष्ण ओके वृंदावन दैट इन वृंदावन इन दोज हु आर लिविंग दैट अवर नंद नंदन कृष्ण इज देयर ऑल टुगेदर विद ऑल हिज पैराफर्नलियस दैट वृंदावन इज आर आराध्य वस्तु ओनली नंद नंदन कृष्ण दैट्स वाई इट इज टोल्ड देयर दैट भगवान श्री कृष्ण चंद्र that bhajan of bhagwan shri krishna that aradhya that it is vrindavan is all the same this is only equally applicable vrindavan is equally applicable with krishna that is equally applicable that is the equal true that is all the absolute truth that vrindavan is similar to krishna that what radharani is that is krishna that krishna that is radharani 
that radha rani that is krishna they are actually no 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 difference is there radha rani is krishna no radha rani has just uh, uh, manifested this point in front of us radha rani has just already just told this point in front of us what that in kurukshetra dham when krishna when with krishna all those brajvasis came at their radha rani actually just uh, came there and speaking to krishna that kind of uh, thing already told by radha rani to us that she is actually speaking to krishna in front of krishna radha rani speaking that in vrindavan you just go with me to vrindavan now you just need to go to vrindavan with me now that for other person what is there inside their heart that is actually inside their hearts but my heart and my heart and my body all actually one and the same my mind and my heart there is no not at all any difference whether you can think that vrindavan is my heart and my heart is vrindavan is my heart is just taking the form of vrindavan and this vrindavan apart from this vrindavan bhagwan shri krishna Nandan Nandan Krishna Yashoda Nandan Krishna he don't want to stay anywhere else it doesn't mean that he don't want to go anywhere apart from Vrindavan in Bhagavad Gita Mahapurana also that by going to Mathura that kind of prasang it's already written there that kind of hidden uh, secret is already written there and i have already told in lot of katha hari katha the actual thing here is that that jeev goswami pad actually speaking that nandan nandan krishna nandan nandan krishna he will not at all leave vrindavan and will not go to any place at all he is not at all going to any place by just uh, uh, from vrindavan so how krishna has gone to mathura that the question actually coming the actual answer to this question that he has gone to dwarka in this there actually one uh, reason is there prabhupad already in the upanishad also it is written jeev goswami pad has given lot of uh, reasoning behind this that why nandan nandan shri krishna that he always stay he always stays in vrindavan he and is not at all going away from vrindavan then where he is actually he is actually there in hidden form krishna has just told this point krishna has just told this point that uh, i am actually just staying in a very hidden form and what kind of bhav is there that what kind of prem prema you have for me this in order to just taste that i am just getting into the hidden form so that i can taste that prema and after that uh, that mathura this krishna is already there dwarka this krishna is also there so this said some difference is there but nandan nandan krishna they are nandan nandan krishna that mathura dish krishna dwarka dish krishna everything is nandan nandan krishna only everything is there in nandan nandan krishna only and they haven't come from any place apart from that they haven't come to uh, they only that's why radha rani in kurukshetra radha rani in kurukshetra at the battlefield of kurukshetra she is uh, that at the time of the battlefield there in kurukshetra where the battle was going on at that place only that there is two ponds there are two uh, ponds there and uh, in between all those yadav vanshis everyone is there and uh, over everyone actually is coming there and uh, all the gopikas and radharani all they have just yashoda anand baba everyone has just came there they just want to meet they, they just came there to meet krishna and radharani at that time actually speaking to krishna that what is there inside the heart of other they they have something else but my heart and vrindavan is all the same my heart my mind everything is vrindavan 
इट मीन्स दैट माई माइंड इज जस्ट हैज टेकन द फॉर्म ऑफ वृंदावन इन विच वृंदावन आई एम दैट काइंड ऑफ मधुर लीला इज देयर इन ईच एंड एवरी प्लेस दैट दिप इफ इन बृहद भागवतामृत ईच एंड एवरी डिस्कशन इज देयर इफ एक्चुअली सम वन इज थिंकिंग दैट द वृंदावन लीला यू कैन जस्ट सी इन द्वारका दैन इट इज नॉट एट ऑल पॉसिबल वृंदावन लीला कैन ओनली बी पॉसिबल इन वृंदावन देर इज वन नव वृंदावन देयर एक्चुअली भगवान श्री कृष्ण वॉट काइंड ऑफ भाव हैज जस्ट गॉट इन साइड द हार्ट ऑफ कृष्ण एंड वॉट कंडीशन ऑफ कृष्ण वॉज देयर इट्स ऑलरेडी डेयर इन बृहद बृहद भागवता अमृत आई एम एक्चुअली जस्ट स्टार्टिंग इट ऑलरेडी गोइंग ऑन बृहद भागवता अमृत डिस्कशन फ्रॉम लास्ट टू टू थ्री ईयर्स सो आई हैव जस्ट डिस्कस्ड इट देयर This is actual correct point. Bhagwan Nandan Nandan Krishna is Aradhya. It means Vrindavan is also Aradhya for Bhagwan. How Krishna actually we will be just doing Aradhana of Krishna. How it is possible? Oh, he is speaking that just under the guidance of Brajvasis. That all those Brajvasis under the how actually Brajvasis have done seva. We need to serve. Krishna, how Gopikas have done seva? According to that, we have to serve Krishna like that. How we have to do seva? That by how actually Gopikas have done seva? That Gopikas have done seva of Krishna. By that only we have to do seva like that, similar to that. सेम लाइक दैट दैट सेवा ओनली वी जस्ट नीड टू डू लाइक दैट दैट कृष्ण दैट इज द एक्चुअल अप्रूवल ऑफ कृष्ण एंड द एक्चुअल प्रूफ फॉर दिस बुक दैट भागवत जी महापुराण इट्स दैट एक्चुअल विचार ऑफ महाप्रभु वॉट इज रिटर्न देयर that kind of vichar but just by putting in front of us it's already told that shrimad bhagavatam because bhagavat ji mahapuran and krishna is not different from each other it is not at all there is no difference shrimad bhagavatam is amalam mahaprabhu has already told this point in bhagavat ji mahapuran this kind of reason actual uh, uh, actual proof what is written that is a topmost what mahaprabhu has told in shrimad bhagavatam that it is actually giving us the actual prema that topmost sampatti that topmost treasure that prem is the topmost treasure in the bangla katha also that i have just told one to one and a half hours before this thing that that this property land this and jewelry gold silver this is not at all uh, uh, this is not at all uh, treasure this by when you will be leaving your body you will be also leaving this uh, all things but uh, prem is the topmost treasure mahaprabhu told this point prem dhan bina vyartho doritra jivan prem dhan bina vyartho doritra jivan das kori pitan more deho prem mahapujin mahaprabhu already told this point to us that without prem dhan the our life is actually useless that our our life is just like it is in a very poor condition our life is without prem dhan without prem that treasure our life is uh, very poor without getting prem dhan we are actually the topmost poorer person in this whole society this kind of vichar we have that if we have a lot of money property then he is a very rich person but sanatan goswami pas vichar is not like that सनातन गोस्वामी पद स्पीकिंग शील रूप गोस्वामी पद गोस्वामी लोग हु हैज डन द भजन ऑफ महाप्रभु अंडर देयर गाइडेंस दैट्स व्हाई महाप्रभु टोल्ड दैट दैट विदाउट प्रेम धन द अदर काइंड ऑफ ट्रेजर व्हाट यू आर फाइंडिंग इट इज नॉट एट ऑल एप्लीकेबल एवरीथिंग यू विल जस्ट लीव नथिंग विल स्टे एट ऑल बाय लिविंग बॉडी एवरीथिंग विल गेट Gone. So that's why prema is the topmost thing. Apart from that, nothing is more topmost. That is the actual vichar of Mahaprabhu. Nal Kuber. They have so much false ego. They have shown Nal Kuber. They have shown false ego, no? Naraji Maharaj actually speaking. Ashoto Shivadan Doshodari Dham Parvanja. Ashod Bhaktiyo 
that for asad people that that poor is poor thing is very good because if they will be having lot of money and position then false ego will just get uh, or taken birth inside the mind if they are having no money then it, that is good because at that time no false ego is there at all that false ego to get there it's not at all possible to have false ego that's why pre- previously we at the starting only it is already told that that i am male i am female i am actually male this kind of vichar you just need to throw away and bhagwan shri krishna the kripa of bhagwan shri krishna that under the guidance of some ramanuga devotees via that will come to me that i will be just getting full kripa i will be just getting uh, success in my life and and by shri krishna kripa that i will be just uh, taking up the gopi swarup transcendental swarup i will get i will stay in vrindavan with the gopi swarup i just want this jeevatma is everyone is uh, 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 streaming feeling means uh, she and shrimati radha rani rani i just want to do the anugatya of shrimati radha rani i i just want to do the anugatya of shrimati radha rani that is radha anuchari Shrimati Radha Rani is anugatya just by doing that that kind of parakya ras that swakya and parakya both which are are there and the poet actually speaking that Shrimati Radhika's lotus feet that Shrimati is uh, Radha Rani is dasya apart from that no other kind of dasya we require that kind of Radha Krishna vilas the aprakrit transcendental vilas leela of radha krishna that shri shri radha govind's transcendental aprakrit vilas this in this vilas i just want to become the servant there i just want to become one sevika there i just want to take the uh, sevika swarup there female swarup so that i can just serve radha govind radha krishna vilas but this is not a normal point it is very easy to speak but practically to follow that it's very difficult if i we will be just be speaking like das goswami then it is not at all good the first thing is that that inside our heart this kind of aprakrit bhav has come or not this aprakrit bhav has come or not it means that what is your actual desire that what is your actual desire inside your heart this is in order to just see that it is very much important first rupanuga bhajan and to do raganuga bhajan what vishwana chakravarti pad has just told in a very simple and clear uh, uh, point that he has just uh, uh, put rag patar mchandrika in front of us i am actually very much uh, i am putting uh, dandwat onto his lotus feet for this kind of effort he has put other people are just thinking it opposite way lot of people are actually thinking the opposite way jiska zindagi mein in the in the life of those people that kind of greediness because without greediness this kind of thing is not at all possible the in ragmarg bhajan that greed is the topmost thing which you need to acquire by greediness only by greediness only you will get that type of uh, motivation inside your heart in raganuga bhajan in raganuga bhajan raganuga bhajan to greediness is the topmost thing which you need to get if you don't have greediness then you have nothing you have at all if greediness is not there nothing is there then uh, if greediness is not there then what you will uh, what you will get from ragvatam chandika that kind of greediness actual greediness what you require in that uh, greediness bhav just by getting that you just need to uh, have the vichar of what you whether you are eligible or not eligible if the greediness you are getting then how it is get uh, you are getting that greediness towards a particular bhav then uh, you are eligible 
greediness is not at all getting uh, by any kinds of rules and regulation the actual characteristics of greediness the actual characteristic of uh, greediness that greediness uh, don't want to uh, don't want to uh, permit anything else greediness don't want to hear anything at all don't want that there is one uh, very nice girl from a very big uh, uh, family he has just got a prema with one motor mechanic and in any how he just need to get merry with that motor mechanic so now what to get how to do that so when greediness she is getting then she is leaving everything what is whatever is coming in the way of her that at the time of getting that greediness he she don't have uh, getting this kind of which are thinking that she is getting greediness towards that boy that motor mechanic so definitely she going to need that she is not at all thinking that she is from a very big family so that big point regarding this that that bar raag batam chandrika in raag var raag raag var means that the raag marg varm means marg the bar means the pathway what you need to follow of the raag marg raag varm chandrika what do you mean by that raag varm that anurag bhajan raag majan that that actual pathway what is there that actual pathway of raag varm in the in that chandrika that all kind of light of the, of the moon light moonlight is actually going in that just when slowly steadily is actually increasing his bhakti in the raag marg if a, if you are blind then okay those who are actually without eyes that those they have all the shastra shastra eyes if they have all the shastra eyes that that guru vani's eye guru vani eyes chakshu by those eyes of the guru vani that according to the guru parampara each and every vichar then only that tatva chakshu you can get tatva eyes you can get by the kripa of guru vishnu bhagwan they are not at all ready to just follow the rules and regulation of the shastra in vedi bhakti because the in the in the case of getting greediness in the case of getting greediness inside your heart inside your heart previously no which are actually will come but automatically how you will get greediness you don't know in the vishay in the process of getting greediness the, this kind of vichar is not at all coming inside you you are getting greediness how you are getting you don't know that so in the in the in the vishay of low uh, greediness there is no analysis no kind of thinking is coming in that but but we have to go according to the rules and regulations of the shastras we just need to follow the shastras we have to go according to the rules and regulations so that we can follow the strict rules and regulations of the shastras we just need to do follow the strict regulatory principles of shastras why because if i will not be following the shastra if i because i am from vidhi marg i am actually following vidhi marg that's why i just need to go on that that according to the shastra we have to follow the under the under the anugatya of guru vishnu bhagwan slowly steadily by just uh, following them if sometimes in our life this kind of thing will happen that automatically that kind of greediness for that some particular bhav i am getting the there is actually misinterpretation of greediness going on lo greed lo means greediness narottam thakur actually speaking in his kirtan nowadays i have this kind of desire to just discuss each and every kirtan narottam das thakur ji that uh, he ha- who has uh, he has already written one kirtan regarding this that the people thinking that uh, narottam das thakur is actually established in mano dharma prabhupad ji always used to speak this point that the actual seva of bhagwan that uh, that is not the actual point of mano dharma that's why you can see that in the first shloka it is already written
परित्यजो प्राकृतो बुकुरादिश so that is already told narottam das thakur kirtan lot of people are actually just um, giving mis uh, they, are, they are actually just giving misguiding and they are just putting wrong questions regarding that shila prabhupa ji actually speaking regarding that that what narottam das thakur has told that krishna das kaviraj go swami has already told this point to us that krishna das ko kaviraj go swami also told to deho kuriya bhavan rakti dine kore bruje krishna sevan bole it's it's written here that inside our heart inside our heart that siddh deh bhavana that kind of uh, that i am actually gopi this kind of vichar that day and night that word actually it's written here they have actually misused or this word all those people the actual first point here is that that the kind of greediness that transcendental greediness towards krishna i will be just loving krishna how i will be doing seva of krishna how i will be loving krishna just by gopi kas which gopi we have to just take the bhav that kind of greediness which you will develop that greediness which you will develop that it is in this material world that inside the heart of all those material people this is just like one whimsical attitude that kind of greediness what is coming inside their heart that that kind of transcendental greediness you cannot compare that at all that low greediness that is actually that is the mental concoction of mano dharma it is not mentally it, concocted idea man hi man that inside your heart that you are understanding that you are gopi that this kind of vichar is not at all good that is it is not at all spoken here like that narottam das thakur actually not at all speaking this point in front of us krishnas kaviraj was not at all speaking this point in front of us that lobha that mano dharma lobh greediness that is which is, those who are actually going with mental speculative mood for them that all those mentally concocted ideas they have that is not at all lobh we are that is not at all greediness but all those sahajiyas external people they are speaking this point that what had actually spoken here they have just straight away just given this kind of meaning to that मोने निजो सिद्ध देव कुरिया भवन रात्रि दिने करे बजे कृष्ण सेवा ये तो बताया दिस ऑलरेडी टोल्ड बाय नरोत्तम दास ठाकुर इन हिस कीर्तन एक्चुअल पॉइंट इज नॉट लाइक दैट व्हाट ही स्पीकिंग दिस इज एक्चुअली अ डिफरेंट थिंग ऑल टुगेदर बहुत सारे लॉट ऑफ थिंग्स आर देयर रिगार्डिंग दिस ऑल दोस सहजियास देयर विचार in order to just uh, cut into pieces and throw away we can break and cut into pieces all the countless species we need to cut that siddhant vichar of sahajiyas and have to throw away we definitely going to cut that why because this vichar is totally wrong that is totally misconception narottam das thakur ji has just written the kirtan which kirtan narottam das thakur written vichar koruna hoibe bishoy vasana mor kobe tuchh hobe bishoy chhariya kobe shuddha hobe mon kobe ham herobo sri bindavan So Narottam Das Thakur ji actually writing this uh, kirtan that nichai chand mercy when it will be just uh, raining on me that the actual uh, actual mercy of nichai chand will be getting on my head and when those material desires for name fame position la puja pratishtha when all actually just like stool and urine i'll be just seeing that it is not is it nothing is there in this when i'll be see that kind of darshan in that after that narottam das thakur what he has spoken it means 
that for us he has given this kind of instruction you just need to you just need to remove all the anarth you just need to remove all kind of material desires in from your heart only then this actually is told here in this kirtan by narottam das thakur for us only that narottam das thakur inside is that heart is contaminated his heart is contaminated some material vishay is there inside the heart of narottam das thakur no not at all he is actually writing for all us all bonded jeevas like us and after just getting purified after the moving on earth by pure guru vishnu kripa when you will be getting the vrindavan darshan when you will be getting you don't have any kind of vrindavan darshan then how you can start your rupa nugraha nugraha bhajan when there is you have there is no pathway that you can go out of that anarth and material desires you cannot get out of that that actually there is no name no point of getting out of this material desire then how you can do rupa nugraha nugraha bhajan how you will be just following ragavatam chandrika then no use of just following that so that in this way it's already told dr bhavadi madhur ji sute dhirya apika achanak automatically just by following vidhi mark slowly steadily under the anugatya of pure guru vishnu guru vishnu ka that to, from the lotus mouth of pure guru vishnu that to that transcendental uh, braj bhumi jo that braj The, all those braj gopigas etc all braj vasis just by hearing the seva of them inside my heart i am feeling very much anand uh, i am feeling that if this kind of seva i can also do inside my life also i can do for krishna if i can get that seva then it will be very good automatically this kind of greediness automatically nobody has just uh, teach you like uh, to a dog someone has taught something and for the to the parrot also someone actually just uh, you will be just uh, speaking to that parrot so uh, he will be just speaking that parrot all the time he will be speaking that particular word what you have just given him the teaching it's not like that it is automatic process just from the lotus mouth of pure guru vishnu by chance i can cross with this with this seva mood just this this kind of seva mood is actually just pushing my heart oh bhagwan so nice seva if this kind of seva i can get in my life then i will be just becoming the topmost uh, i can get the topmost treasure this kind of greediness lob should be there and this greediness you will get by very topmost luck this kind of greediness in each and every one heart it is not at all possible to get so after that that in order to get that particular object that kind of greediness what you are developing that kind of process what it is like the case in which uh, vishe you are getting that lobe and okay you are getting greediness that's good but after that automatically is done and in order to get that particular object what you are feeling greediness what to do for that what is the process i need that i need that uh, particular object definitely i need that that because greediness is getting but in order to uh, just uh, get that uh, uh, greediness towards a particular uh, what all process you need to follow in order to follow those process it is very much important to follow those process na tru shastro na juktin cha tat lob utpatti lakshana isme shravan in this shravan shravan is the top most thing Shravan is the topmost thing in this. Prabhupad, actually speaking, that Krishna Seva, Krishna Krishna Seva is the actual work of transcendental body, and by this material sense organs and material body, by that, by our material sense organs and material mind and body, that transcendental Krishna Seva is not at all possible to do. transcendental uh, krishna seva cannot be done by that whether you can just speak loudly and just cry loudly whatever sahajiyas whatever kind of cry you can do loudly but you have a lot of uh, money power with you but it will not help you to get the actual transcendental treasure nothing can happen our gaur kishor das baba ji maharaj that one sahajiya ko sai has just came to him and speaking that maharaj i actually want to just learn raganuga bhajan okay mabaji were speaking i don't have time today you just go away today 
and he just went away and after that again he is coming to babaji maharaj and speaking the same question that babaji maharaj speaking the same answer that i don't have any time to just to speak and after that again he has gone and again he is coming some day and is speaking that he just do some kripa so that i can just get some ragana bhajan i don't have any time you just go away you are actually speaking when you will be getting the time to just show us what is ragana ka bhajan after that is becoming very much angry each and every time i'm coming to you and you are speaking that i don't have any time what you are actually speaking i he is actually becoming angry with baba ji maharaj and after that going away from that place that whatever actually he is uh, speaking all rubbish to baba ji maharaj and speaking and going away from that place and gor kishor das baba ji maharaj just laughing inside his heart he actually started speaking <laughs> even he actually he actually thinking of one paisa that even for one paisa he is actually getting so much uh, uh, getting attracted to that and he will be just doing raganu ka bhajan <laughs> you see now this is the case even one penny one pence also he don't want to just waste and he will be doing raganu ka bhajan go to the market go to the market and buy books and after that you can just read that that's it you can just uh, take raganu ka bhajan <laughs> baba ji maharaj speaking that just by taking books from outside they are just started reading that and they are thinking that they are actually become raganu ka devotee they are becoming gopi like that hmm so this is the actual condition what to do so so this is the actual thing kya baat hai the whole civilization has changed and as well as the human civilization as well so go to show us baba ji mera speaking that they have lot of money inside their pocket okay you can go to the market and can just buy a lot of books from the market go you have so much lot of money inside your pocket that but where you will get that actual realization you tell me where you will get that actual realization tell me yeah realization you will not get in the market no realization is not at all possible in market how you will get in market realization can only be done by the seva of pure guru vishnu if you don't have done any guru pure guru vishnu seva you are not at all loving guru vishnu then he will be doing raga nuga bhajan very nice oh so nice <laughs> this is one kind of joking prabhupad actually speaking krishna seva that krishna seva krishna seva is not an ordinary thing prabhupad actually speaking that the bhakti siddhan saraswati go swami thakur prabhupad speaking prabhupad actually speaking krishna seva that krishna seva it is not a normal and ordinary thing that by the ordinary uh, material sense organs and body you can do that it's not at all possible like that you don't think like that krishna krishna seva shri krishna seva is only done by transcendental body by attributing by attributing by just uh, attributing bhai vishnu chakravarti pad is actually speaking arop siddha bhakti lot of bhakti if i'll be having this kind of time that i'll be definitely discussing this sadhan siddha bhakti arop siddha bhakti lot of bhakti are there lot of uh, points are there what we need to discuss in this arop when you are actually just attributing you are just attributing by attribution that inside your heart that kind of imaginary mentally concocted imaginary ideas by your material body in order to just do krishna seva you are actually instructing others you can't do that goswami pad hasn't instructed us regarding that our goswami pad hasn't told this point to us that inside your heart you are actually thinking that you are a gopi goswami pad is not at all speaking this point prabhupad actually speaking that krishna seva can can done only by transcendental body and just by attributed Uh, by just thinking imaginary mentally concocted ideas procedure you are following that by that it is not at all possible to do krishna seva the in order to think that i will be doing krishna seva definitely ko swami people they have they haven't told us the actual thing when when you will be getting the transcendental body when while doing bhajan slowly steadily those who are that those that our sanatan goswami path 
एज यस टोल्ड इन बृहद भागवत अमृत वो थी हेज रिटर्न वॉट एक्चुअली हु एज टोल्ड दिस सनातन गोस्वामी जस्ट बाई टेकिंग ऑल द टॉप मोस्ट वरी कथा नेक्टर स्लोली स्टेडली जस्ट गो ऑन डूइंग सेवा विद सेवा मूड ऑफ कृष्णा आफ्टर दैट इन द कमिंग डेज दैट यू विल जस्ट गेट सम काइंड ऑफ पॉजिटिव थिंकिंग एंड यू कैन गेट द एक्चुअल इंटेलिजेंस इन साइड योर माइंड ट्रांसडेंटल इंटेलिजेंस that krishna bhakta that just by drinking the nectar of krishna seva and just by slowly slowly doing seva you are becoming seva mai it means that this body inside this body that kind of transcendental bhav you will get prabhupada actually speaking when that by your aprakrit body transcendental body when you are by your transcendental body you are actually taking the transcendental object you are doing the seva of the transcendental seva of the transcendental object you will be doing that at that time in this material world this stool by this subtle and fine body that kind of transcendental seva it is not at all possible to do it cannot be done it cannot be done it is not at all possible but still एक्सटर्नलीस्टर्नली लाइक द केस लाइक यू आर डूइंग हरी कथा कीर्तन एंड जस्ट बाई स्टोरी स्टैंडली डूइंग कीर्तन दैट यू आर एक्चुअली जस्ट क्राइंग द एक्चुअल क्राइंग दैट इज नॉट काइंड ऑफ कपट कपट क्राइंग दैट आई विल नॉट बी स्पीकिंग द एक्चुअल आई एम स्पीकिंग अबाउट एक्चुअल क्राइंग वॉट यू आर डूइंग आई जस्ट वॉन्ट टू स्पीक दैट दो प्योर गुरु वैष्णव that those pure guru vishnu that in externally by our uh, own uh, imagination we are thinking that by our external thinking that by our external eyes we can see that uh, they are actually just doing seva but there that astasatvik vikar and we are seeing the uh, tears in their eyes we can see that when they are serving that prabhupada actually speaking that when our body has just gone on to the transcendental platform at that transcendental platform krishna seva just by doing krishna seva slowly steadily inside this body inside this body different kind of symptoms can you can it will be visible to us it can be visible so these kind of symptoms by these symptoms we can understand that he is actually just attained that aprakrit bhumi ka transcendental bhumi ka like shila prabhupad in kunj bihari math he is actually just doing hari katha there upadesh amrit there of of rup ko swami pad radha rani the actual in depth which are uh, automatically when radha rani's name came there then immediately Uh, Prabhupada Prabhupada actually inside his heart that kind of just get uh, developed and he just start, and he just start, his katha is just going to get stopped he can't speak automatically it is done this kind of condition automatically has been presented and Prabhupada has just checked himself immediately why because if he will not be checking then Hari Katha will get stopped Hari Katha will get stopped and uh, about mahaprabhu also in chaitanya charitamrita it's, it's already written when all those external people of material the, of this material world are there available then mahaprabhu may not at all express his uh, 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 transcendental mood in front of them and he will check himself that's why in chaitanya charitamrita you can see there actually it is written 
संग देखी प्रभु बहिरंगा ना ऐसा नहीं क्या कहे व्हाट एक्चुअली इज रिटन बहिरंगो व्यक्ति देखी प्रभु कोइलो भाव संगरण बहिरंगो बहिरंगो एक्सटर्नली जस्ट बाय सीइंग द एक्सटर्नल मटेरियल पर्सन जस्ट बाय सीइंग द मटेरियल एक्सटर्नल मटेरियल पर्सन महाप्रभु इमीडिएटली दैट काइंड ऑफ फ्रेम ऑफ व्हाट इज गेटिंग यूज्ड टू चेक दैट इमीडिएटली बहिरंगा देखी प्रभु कोइलो भाव संवरण बहिरंगा देखी प्रभु कोइलो भाव भाव संवरण अपना भाव को चेक दैट ही विल चेक हिज भाव महाप्रभु Prabhupada also have done the same thing, but all those uh, actual life of the pure sadhu, that what, that inside their heart, what kind of bhav is they are having by that bhava, their body is also getting uh, categorized like that. Inside their heart, that what kind of transcendental bhav is there, by that, here their body will also get uh, categorized by that. It means that externally you can see that whatever actually our this body is that of Guru Vaishnav. In that we can see actual kind of transcendental vikar in that. So this is the actual topmost point regarding this. That by forcible, forcibly by forcibly by some kind of imagination you are thinking. that you are actually imagining that you are one gopi and propa speaking that by this gopi only those who have just made one mentally concocted imaginary idea he is just imagining one kind of gopi swarup inside his mind those all kind of foolish people propa speaking that they mentally concocted gopi bhav they have understood that inside their heart by their own mind and heart material mind and heart that by that gopi each and day and night they will be just getting associated with them just be doing uh, association with them propas vichar is like that that kind of uh, body uh, of that gopi he actually just imagine he, he is going to enjoy with that gopi this is our raganuga bhajan this is our upanuga bhajan up till this point we have just got he have got so much increment in our bhajan you see <laughs> foolish shruti mein likha hua hai in shruti also it is written ye to vacho nivartante aprapta manushasah agar man hi if our heart agar hamara man if our heart bachan and our what we are speaking it can go to bhagwan directly then then in upanishad why it is written like that in the shruti in the stuti if our if our if our heart is actually can go to bhagwan then it is okay okay it can go to bhagwan who actually has just uh, told not to go our heart should go towards bhagwan definitely if our material body and mind it is actually our pravachan is actually established in material platform that ab ab our uh, mind body speech if it, if, if it actually is capable of going to bhagwan then why actually we are just getting one kick and we have just returned back it is already written there in the stuti no what it's written when you will be doing more efforts for some person that definitely your material sense organs that material sense organs and our material mind and intelligence if you will be just doing more and more cleverness then you will get a very negative feedback and you will be just getting kicked by maya devi you maya devi will just kick you like uh, an ass and you will just return back from that our mind body and intelligence everything will go away bhagwan in gita actually speaking this point everything is actually going away from us everything is actually material and by this material mind and intelligence in order to get to bhagwan how we can get that it is impossible to go to bhagwan with a material mood and material desire inside our heart so or uh, there is actually eight divisions of this prakriti devi man 
our heart our mind our intelligence false ego everything is actually consist or everything is material everyone this all material body made of five elements everything is material this material conception and material stage because actually it is created from prakriti and by just taking this body we cannot go to bhagwan at all that's why each and every time pro guru our guru work is giving us the warning and in the shastras different kind of shastra vichar is there authentic shastra uh, very very authentic shastras are also there regarding this and in gita also we can understand this point that in gita we have already seen vayu kang mano buddhi devasha ahankar iti amme pradhi rasada chhuta chis is some false thing if some false thing if just by taking the support of false things you can you get the absolute truth well it is possible no not at all just by taking the uh, false support we will you be getting that absolute truth in your life it is not at all possible that's why by our material mind that kind of transcendental transcendental body and chit lila bhavna it is just to think like that it is next to impossible if this word is there apart from that also then you can apply that that's why that aprakrit krishna naam etc it means bhagwan shri krishna's name uh, roop gun leela vashisht everything you just need to prakrit bhumika mein rehna we can just attain that in the uh, normal material uh, uh, platform it is not very really possible to get that at all bhagwan's naam hari katha kirtan it can only just by taking the transcendental uh, thinking and remembering that's why we just need to take krishna naam under the guidance of pure guru vishnu sadhu sangha sadhu sangha sarva sasti ko lago matto sadhu sangha sadhu siddhi sarva siddhi so like this rag vatma chandrika rag rag varma chandrika rag matlab so like this rag varma chandrika that rag means that in uh, natural in the natural way if we will be just uh, taking the uh, chanter at the lotus feet of bhagwan and we will be just uh, confining to do the seva of bhagwan under the guidance of pure guru vishnu that if i will be doing the aprakrit seva of bhagwan i am actually busy in that then if some braj under the guidance anugatya of some brajwasi i will be taking that and doing so what i have i need to do in that that we have to just take the anugatya of that brajwasi under his anugatya slowly steadily by doing bhajan we just need to go in the nitya leela of and seva of bhagwan krishna at that time uh, slowly steadily we will be getting the aprakrit uh, transcendental rasa of that transcendental world uh, forcibly you will not get that transcendental ras our gurudev sant ko swami maharaj sector used to speak in a joking mood that those people who want the rasa they are actually uh, accepting that but they don't know this point that if some foolish people he is actually just running for ras in that same rasa he is actually na uh, getting destroyed by that i'll give you one example what shila sant ko swami bare used to give one example you see that your honey just in order to get honey some place actually some honey he is actually kept there in one uh, in one uh, in one bowl and in that bowl of honey that kind of nice uh, smell actually is coming from the honey and is actually spread in all the four direction 
and all the uh, but um, uh, all the bees honey bees are actually coming into that in order to get that uh, honey and just by taking that honey slowly steadily that they have taken that just by what they have just uh, died by just getting into that uh, honey so this is our actual raganuga bhajan you see just i just want to take the uh, jaggery liquid jaggery i just want to take the transcendental rush but i am actually just getting into that same rush and uh, that um, our uh, and my uh, all those honey bees and birds actually are just uh, using their uh, wings to just uh, fly what they are doing they are using their wings they are actually using their wings to fly they are actually just getting supported by their wings but these wings actually if it actually just getting into samras so that's why they their wings are becoming heavy and because of that just by sticking to that they are actually getting died so this is our actual raganuga rupanu bhajan they will be sticking to that and they will be just dying in that only what to do that our guru work i always used to speak this example so okay what is the case we can't do anything in that so like this in order to just taste the ras each and every person is actually taking some other pathway but they don't know what is the actual swarup of rasa they don't have any kind of information regarding that what which ras you require that you just need the rasa of rasgulla or you just need to take the ras of sugar cane which kind of rasa you want that you need the orange juice ras huh <laughs> in foreign country that our bhakti wala tirth ko swami maharaj has just went and our gurudev actually speaking actually there one sevak actually speaking that i'm actually going with someone that so that i you just gave me some word book so that they, we have to do guru seva like that and from the market he is actually getting that book and yes very good you just need to speak like that in front of gurudev and after that and i have just given him the word book and after that what he has done that in which country he has gone there i don't know whether switzerland or some place he has went i don't know any i because i don't have any kind this kind of eligibility to go and uh, there actually he has just went with gurudev and after just getting uh, there with gurudev and he just want to do some kind of kitchen for gurudev and how he will be actually cooking Uh, in parbal what you are actually speaking in english he is actually thinking like that and card god and after that he is actually just getting into the kitchen room and he is speaking that sugar is not all the uh, that sugar is not at all there actually okay sugar you require they have just taken 5 kg sugar they have taken maharaj why you have taken so much sugar he actually just become surprised are i don't need sugar only one sugar just by taking one box of sugar only you require yes what kind of sugar you need you tell you ask gurudev that which which sugar you want cane sugar or other kind of sugar i haven't maharaj actually i haven't heard this kind of sugars are there in the kitchen oh my god i just become confused that in one kitchen so much sugar is there so this is the case so like this this is our by our own uh, <coughs> thinking we are uh, taking this that kind of ras which kind of ras you need a sugar cane ras or you need apple juice ras which kind of ras you need <laughs> we they, you can't speak that because you don't have any information regarding that what is the actual ras what do you mean by ras you don't have any kind of information regarding that ras so that's why he is thinking that this is actually material ras just male and female they are actually exchanging ras sugar cane ras rasgulla ras they are actually thinking that but by this you cannot do raganuga rupanuga bhajan you cannot get entry into that at all shila sachidan bhaktivinoda thakur ji also as uh, just uh, actually praying on to lotus feet of ras yeah are yeah, he is actually praying on to lotus feet of ras how it is possible bhakti no thakur actually that transcendental ras there is some swarup is there everything is there and bhakti no thakur speaking that he is swarup he ras that you just do keep on us are ras can do keep us yes definitely that up the transcendental ras of the transcendental world it is it has some swarup and bhakti no thakur speaking that oh ras you just give keep on me 
so that i can do raganuga so that i can understand the actual ras that's mean ras also has a, a separate identity separate swarup chila rup goswami pad also has told if some people if some person that kind of material bhavna that kind of limit material bhavna also have some limit no so actually some person every one person every person has to accept that that our mental mental imagination that mental bhav then it should be having some uh, limit because it is also material that whatever material is there some or certain limit is must be there some or certain limit must be there so because it is limited so our bhavna and our imagination is actually have some limitation so but inside this limit also that transcendental thing uh, of of the transcendental world cannot come at all in that it is not at all coming no it is an it is a finite object that's why shila rup ko swami pad actually just speaking openly in front of us and as is actually writing yas chamatkar bharu hridi sapt jale varam satate sartam he sapt sibi na it means that when the anarth is gone from your outside from your heart when your heart will become purified only at that after just your heart is becoming purified that proper topmost satyagun can shuddha satyagun can get inside your heart by the kripa of your guru vaishnav it is just one kind of brightness can illuminate the whole world inside each and every heart that kind of transcendental bhav can just come inside our heart this urja vrat we are speaking no that is the topmost that urja vrat that that ujeshwari radharani can do the topmost kripa under the guidance of the lotus feet of ujeshwari radharani all the four directions there is just uh, uh, light everywhere on those who can just take they can take otherwise you can just get lost this after after getting bandhara in vrindavan they are actually speaking that radharani bandhara is open for all everyone if someone can just loot it someone can loot otherwise just go away if you can't loot it that is ar rag varma chandrika that the ras bandhara of the ras we can just get that he can take it otherwise he can just get lost that's it that ras is that is the actual definition of the rasa that is the exact that is the exact definition of rasa tattva when rup ko swami pad actually speaking that uh, material bhavna what is there inside that limit is there in your mind and heart when you will be just crossing uh, that limit you will be crossing over that limit you will just go to such a platform that that kind of topmost magical condition you will get in your life what kind of magic condition that inside your heart there is no kind of material things but still inside your heart you are actually all the time feeling uh, transcendental blissfulness that kind of topmost satvik bhav that kind of uh, wave will be going on then the katha the leela hari katha of bhagwan it will just be it will be just uh, uh, getting some motivation to get some realization about some rasa tattva that is the appropriate time different kind of ras in relation to the beauties of bhagwan ka sundar jo the actual opulence is uh, the actual leela of bhagwan everything you will be finding very attractive for you you will be getting one kind of that is called rasa you can understand what i am speaking that is actually called rasa otherwise whatever the material people of this material world are there though who those who want to just get uh, getting you the cheating propensity you will be getting in that is not at all rasa bhakti vinod thakur speaking that uh, go you come i will be just teaching you the rasa tatva they are actually topmost fraudster 
भक्ति में ठाकुर स्पीकिंग दे आर नंबर वन फ्रॉड स्टार दैट रस कैन नॉट यू कैन नॉट टीच रस भजन टू एनी वन रस भवन रस भजन इज नॉट एट ऑल अ थिंग टू टीच सम वन ऑटोमेटिकली इफ सम वन कैन गेट सिद्धि इन द रस तत्व देन दिस यू कैन नॉट टीच टू एनी वन दैट रस भजन आई विल बी जस्ट टीचिंग आई विल बी जस्ट टीचिंग रूपानुग और रागानुग भजन यू जस्ट कम टू मी दिस इज एक्चुअली नंबर वन फ्रॉड स्टर चीटर नंबर वन भक्ति ठाकुर स्पीकिंग इज चीटर नंबर वन रस भजन इज एक्चुअली अ थिंग टू टीच नो इट्स नॉट एट ऑल वर्णाश्रम धर्म कैन नेवर बी टॉट इट्स नॉट अ मैटर ऑफ टीचिंग सो यू विल बी कमिंग टू मी एंड आई विल बी जस्ट गिविंग यू दिस रस तत्व ऑटोमेटिकली दिस इट कैन नॉट बी टॉट इट इज ऑटोमेटिक बट द पर्सन आर गोइंग ऑन अ रॉन्ग वे वॉट टू डू इन दैट दैट इज कॉल्ड रसा दैट वेन अवर हार्ट इज बिकमिंग गेटिंग द शुद्ध सात्विक भाव इन साइड दैट काइंड ऑफ वेव इज गोइंग इन साइड अवर हार्ट एंड ऑल द फोर डायरेक्शन देर इज एक्चुअली लाइट एंड लाइट इन साइड अवर हार्ट नाउ एक्चुअली देर इज डार्कनेस वॉट काइंड ऑफ डार्कनेस द एक्चुअल डार्कनेस ऑफ अन नॉलेज अन नॉलेज नो नॉलेज इज देयर दैट डॉकनेस इज देयर दैट एक्चुअल भावना द एक्चुअल भाव वॉट इज देयर इन साइड माई हार्ट दैट काइंड आई एम ऑलवेज थिंकिंग अबाउट दैट लिमिटेड पैथवे ऑफ दिस मटीरियल वर्ल्ड ऑल द टाइम दैट इन ऑर्डर टू जस्ट क्रॉस दैट लिमिट ऑफ दैट मटीरियल भावना दैट अवर लिमिट ऑफ दैट मटीरियल भावना वैन यू विल बी क्रॉसिंग ओवर दैट लिमिट मटीरियल भावना एंड द काइंड ऑफ थिंकिंग वी हैव then when we will be the crossing of our limit and uh, in with that kind that kind of magical situation or condition that will arise inside our in our in our heart then definitely that shuddh satva will definitely get uh, inside our heart it will get manifested inside our heart jalevaram sidhi satva jalevaram ujjal that ujjal that so much brightness is not at all there that kind of brightness that is not a kind of a glittering thing it is more than that there actually it is written that hridi satto jale varam very very bright that is inconceivable that it is out of our uh, thinking when we will be getting this kind of condition then some kind of realization we can get inside our heart we will be just getting some taste of that uh, topmost uh, rasa satyate me can be satyate it can be tested that you can just taste that you can just taste that particular rasa that is called rasa that is called rasa that is called rasa and now you can think that what kind of rush you want to take apple raw that apple raw juice that you need apple juice or pineapple juice or whether you need sugar cane juice you just take the decision and uh, tomorrow i'll be discussing on this point uh, tomorrow definitely i want to uh, talk tomorrow on this point as well that is impossible which is very amazing and surprising to hear that uh, this book rag varma chandrika that all those under the anugatya of uh, sahajiya i don't want to just uh, uh, i don't have this desire to discuss this book under the association of sahajiya i want to actually uh, discuss this book under the association of bhakti vinod thakur shila prabhupad bhakti san saraswati thakur and shila keshav goswami maharaj and i am ready to just discuss that under their guidance and uh, i will not be just listening the actual talkings of sahajiya they are actually all foolish number one so they are all cheaters so i will not be discussing under their guidance so the what kind of vichar is actually coming in front of us that in the in the vichar actual vichar they are actually speaking that uh, it's written here in this book that that is the actual first step only i am failure we are failure in the first step only itself that our false ego is not at all going so whose false ego has gone completely the f- in the first step only we are actually failure that kind of false ego we are not at all able to just cut it from our material life so what to do how to go more ahead in this uh, bhajan life radhika anuchori radha krishna radhika anuchori bhutva parokiyo rashe parokiyo rashe sada 
राधा कृष्ण विलासेशु परिचर्याम करो मी अहम दैट इज माय एब्सुलुट दैट इज माय एब्सुलुट डिजायर इन माय लाइफ और दिस शुड बी द एब्सुलुट डिजायर इन माय लाइफ अभिमानम परित्यज्यो प्राकितो बपुरादिशु श्री कृष्ण कृपया गोपी देहे ब्रजे वसा अहम राधानुचरी भूत्वा पारकीयो रसे सदा राधा कृष्ण विलासेशु परिचर्या करोमि अहम वाछकल्पतुष के पास सिंधु विवश पतितान पावन भविष्य नमो नमः